Canva versus Kittle. Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be talking about Canva versus Kittle. So you're already familiar with Canva. However, once we talk about Kittle, Kittle is this very new but still competitive graphic designing tool that we're going to be using today. So as of Canva, Canva really aims at general users needing simple and versatile designs. However, Kittle, you know, really targets your designers needing detailed vector graphics and typography. You can see this is very much aimed to design t-shirt logos, hoodies and sweatshirts. You can see how intricate all these designs are right here. Almost gives off like a Pinteresty vibe to me. And then Kittle really specializes in these detailed vector illustrations and typographic designs. On the other hand, Canva only really focuses on providing range of templates and editing tools. So this is like they give you basically like the building blocks as of Canva. Canva is more of so like the basics you would say and Kittle is more of like the Pinteresty version of Canva. Canva offers you so many templates at the same time Kittle does as well, but it is really limited to how you can take it. Let's just say you want to work on marketing, stationery, apparel, you're going to go ahead on Kittle and start using it. Now next up, you can also add advanced text manipulation and effects which are ideal for creating all these typographic designs. You can add different textures and also even vintage effects. Let's start off by creating one. If you can go ahead or discover t-shirts right here which is pretty cool if I would look into it. Like this one right here, you have Y2K, you have the different editing designs right here. Now, as for uh, if you talk about its design workflow, Kiddo focuses on high quality vector graphics and typography, making it suitable for professional design workflows. And it also provides options for exporting high quality, high resolution and vector formats, which is ideal for print usage. So this is the template that we're working on. We can simply either print it or download it or even select mock up. You can see the interface is also pretty easy, drag and drop, just like how it is on Canva. Now, when it comes to Canva, however, you can also add in third-party integrations like Google Drive, Dropbox, social media platforms, like let's just say we want to share this off. There are multiple different options for us to publish. You can share the link, you can share it on LinkedIn, your social media platforms, download it on your Google Drive, and even send it off onto messaging apps. Now, once we talk about the pricing, however, Canva offers you a basic free plan as well as a pro plan which is like $12 per month. Now Kittle on the other hand offers you a free plan which offers you very limited access to templates and these features. So you basically cannot know, you know, dip your hand into the pool entirely to know how Kittle works unless until you have their pro plan which is like $10 per month. And they offer so much more higher 4K resolution, so much more features, advanced templates, and amazing exports as well. So this is it, guys, the difference between Kittle and Canva.